Hey everyone, this is Sly here with Flo, and today we're gonna talk about an under the radar guy that me and you, Flo, are kind of excited about. Now, Jordan Matthews, second year being a tight end for the 49ers, and Flo, he looks yoked, man. He looks ready to go. He just got back from tight end university. What are your thoughts, man? And do you think he's got a chance at making this team? Yeah, man, it definitely looks like he, uh, changed his body in order to really look like a tight end this year he obviously played a little bit last year but he didn't really look the part now man he's definitely added on that size he looks big he's been working with these guys the only thing man we're really deep at tight end obviously we got george kittle who's our main guy then we got the practice uh practice player stud in ross dwelly who always does good uh charlie warner who's a really good uh pass blocking uh, tight end and he's really good in the run and then we also picked up was it Tyler Croft who's kind of a hybrid guy himself so that's already four guys then you had Jordan Matthews and then man we just have plenty of guys in this tight end group um, obviously he's a hard worker kind of uh, being related to uh, the GOAT and Jerry Rice but I don't know if I see him man it's just I just see way too much depth and I know we'll probably keep him at least for our practice squad, but I don't know if he'll make the official team. But what do you think, Sly? Yeah, man, it's going to be tough. And we also got Tanner Hudson, too. And he's the one that had pretty much did a really good catch, a few catches in the mini camp. So we're really stacked right now. I mean, he looks the part, though, man. I mean, let's be, I was looking at it, um, his stats and stuff, and his eight, he's only 29 years old. That's a thing. So I'm like, what? This guy, I thought he was in the league for like 10, 15 years, but he's only 29 years old. Remember, he was a first-round pick from Philadelphia, and he had a few years where he actually was really really good so I mean if he could block I know last year he did struggle in the blocking game but it was his first year as tight end guys if he could pick that up and um, like learn from the best maybe gets a few pointers to how he got at the tight end university I think he's got a chance because he was a stud receiver and if he could just learn how to block he might have a chance because the talent that he has I know he's a fast dude like a 4-4 guy He's got all the talent in the world. I don't know, man. Like I said, if someone gets hurt, I think he's going to be the one caught up. Like you said, I agree he's going to make the practice squad because it seems like he's always making the practice squad. Like for the past two years, he's always on the practice squad or something with us. So um, I do like him. I think he's a deep threat, a vertical threat. It's going to be tough. Like you said, it's a fair to make the team, but I think he's got a chance, man. Yeah, man. Um, and the good thing about this Niner tight end group, we have depth, so mm -hmm. like you said, every year we get injuries, so we're gonna be able to fill in a few guys, but as far as right now, I'm gonna say no, I'm gonna say he's gonna be on the practice squad. Yeah, maybe if he get a special teams, maybe if he could go to the special teams, maybe that he could get uh, make it to the team because, you know, like I said, we do sometimes carry three, four tight ends. I know a lot of times Kyle Shanahan likes keeping six, seven receivers. So, you don't, I don't know, man. It just depends um, if he's going to be able to block, if he's going to be able to play special teams because that right now he's 29 years old. He's not over the hill yet. He's still almost in his prime you could say so i hit the guy is yoked man the guy looks like the incredible hulk man the guy's been bulking people have been saying on the comments saying man you look freaking jack man and he does so like you said i think he's going to be on the outside looking in but if he has a big big training camp big preseason he could do it man he could surprise us and i wouldn't be shocked at all yeah and this is a good problem for the 49ers but you guys let us know in the comments what you guys think about jordan matthews uh chances of making this team like comment subscribe hit that notification bell we'll see y'all next time peace, peace.